you have your Bible with you today, please open up to the book of Isaiah. Isaiah chapter 51 and Isaiah chapter 52. Oh, thank you. So excited, forgot to turn my mic on. now in place. Let us turn our attention to God's Word. I wanted to go back to my favorite book this morning. We'll take a week off from looking at the judgments that are predicted in the book of Revelation to come back to Isaiah's book of comfort. You see, the book of Isaiah is my favorite because it contains the entire story of the Bible. It gives us that macro picture of what God is doing in the world from the very beginning. In Genesis, as Isaiah often goes back to referring to what God did when he created the heavens and the earth, then going through Israel's history and their failure, then showing what God's plan is in order to redeem not only his nation of Israel, but to redeem the whole world. And Isaiah contains some of the most amazing and powerful prophecies about the person and work of the Lord Jesus Christ. And then it goes on beyond the cross to the new heaven and the new earth and all of the blessings that God has in store for those who put their trust in him. And so the book of Isaiah is a miniature Bible telling us the whole story from beginning to end. And it talks about creation, fall, redemption, and then the final restoration in the new heaven and the new earth. And it's a wonderful, wonderful book. We finished our study.